Hey guys, in today's video, I'm doing a full in-depth breakdown of Keller Williams as a brokerage. Keller Williams is one of the biggest names in real estate, so if you're considering them or if you were just curious about the model, then this will be one of the most in-depth breakdowns on Keller Williams that is available. Choosing a real estate brokerage is a very important decision, which is why I wanted to do this full breakdown for anyone who may find it valuable. I have been with Keller Williams for over three years now and I have been really happy with that decision. So I'm going to be sharing based on my personal experience and my research on the company as far as everything that they have to offer their agents as a brokerage. I'm going to be going over in depth the seven pillars of the Keller Williams model, which is commission, training, technology, profit share, brand recognition, support, and culture. This is going to be a longer video for those that want a full overview of the company, but I'm going to be leaving timestamps here and chapters of each pillar for those who want to jump around. Also, if throughout this video you have any additional questions about Keller Williams or the model or anything that maybe I didn't cover, then just feel free to email me. I'll leave my email in the description below as well. I do also want to make it clear that that although Keller Williams as a franchise is run with the framework, each brokerage office is independently owned and operated, and a lot of this information is based on my own independent research, so make sure that you talk with your local office and verify with any questions that you need to ask them. So let's start with the commission structure, which is very important because it directly impacts how much you get paid and get to take home. As real estate agents, we are paid a commission when we sell a home. We then split that commission with our brokerage for sponsoring our license. The amount that we pay our brokerage is referred to as the commission split, and Keller Williams has one of the most generous commission splits and structures for their agents. The commission split is the same across all offices for all agents, there are no special exceptions, and everyone is treated the same. The commission split is 70-30 with an additional 6% going to the franchise, so if you make a commission for $10,000, you will pay your office $3,000 and the franchise an additional $600, leaving you the agent with $6,400 to take home. This is a fair commission split as commissions are usually anywhere between 10 and 50% split, but what makes this model even more attractive is the fact that it includes a commission cap. This cap means that once you pay Keller Williams a set amount for the year, you're able to keep one hundred percent of your commissions for the remainder of your calendar year from the month that you joined Keller Williams. So if you originally joined the company in May and you cap in September, that means that you're able to keep 100% of your commissions until the following May. The 6% franchise fee caps at $3,000 annually company wide no matter where you are. The cap that you pay your office varies from office to office and is dependent on your location and market. Generally, this cap will be anywhere from $18,000 to $25,000 annually. This ranges because different areas have differing price points and cost of living and doing business. For example, a Keller Williams office in Indiana will probably have a much lower cap than an office in let's say New York City where the cost of living and doing business is a lot higher. It will generally take somewhere around 8 closed transactions at the average price point of your market to reach your cap. The fact that you can earn 100% of your commission as an agent is a huge benefit and I was shocked when I learned that something like this existed. I did also want to note in full transparency that there may be an additional minimal transaction fee that you will pay after the fact that you cap that helps pay the operations of the brokerage. I'm not 100% sure if every office has this, but if they do, it should be pretty minimal. And for example, in my office, it is $50 per transaction side after you are capped. Since we are now talking about the fees at Keller Williams, now would probably be an appropriate time to also disclose that you may have to pay an additional office fee as well. This office fee, just like the transaction fee, should be pretty minimal and easy to cover no matter how much you're selling. For example, in my office, the fee is $55 a month, which goes towards the resources that are provided to us, 
like a website, technology, and additional resources. So to recap quickly on commission, it starts at a 70-36 split with the franchise fee capping at $3,000 annually and the office fee capping at anywhere generally between $18,000 and $25,000 a year depending on your location, at which point you will earn 100% of your commissions for the remainder of the year paying only a minimal transaction fee. This means that even if you make a million dollars a year, you will still only be paying the brokerage a cap between $18,000 and $25,000 as opposed to let's say a fixed commission of 25% where you would be paying the brokerage $250,000. Now you could probably see why the Keller Williams commission structure is so generous to the agents as opposed to a fixed commission split, but the truth is that even with a commission cap, Keller Williams is still not the cheapest option around when it comes to brokerages. But what you really need to consider when choosing a brokerage, even more important than the commission split, is the value of what you receive from the brokerage in return for what you are paying. And this is exactly what I'll be covering in the remainder of this video, which brings me to the next pillar of the Keller Williams model, which is training. Training, in my opinion, is the most important aspect of being a real estate agent especially new, but even at any level of your career. Keller Williams is renowned for their training and they offer one of the most comprehensive and extensive real estate training programs in the entire industry. KW is commonly acknowledged as the best place for new agents to work, specifically due to the training that they provide. Training is one of the founding principles of Keller Williams, so much so that Keller Williams has been acknowledged by Training Magazine as the number one training organization in the entire world across all industries. Training is taken very seriously at Keller Williams and there are many different elements of the training model to cover. The main elements of the training model include in-person training classes, training courses and programs, coaching programs, live events, and foundational books on real estate. Let's start with the most common form of training that I have found to be very valuable, and that is the in-person training classes that occur in the office. Keller Williams offices release training calendars each month that are filled with daily in-person real estate training classes. These classes are typically hosted by top real estate agents within the office or by outside experts covering a wide array of real estate topics and business strategies. Attending these classes ensures that you are equipped with the knowledge you need around real estate processes and the different aspects and ways of growing your real estate business. These in-person training classes are in my opinion one of the best and most well-rounded real estate training curriculums available in the entire industry. Also remember that these training classes are taught by the top agents in your local office teaching you the processes and tactics that are both relevant and effective in your specific market area because they're using them themselves and are finding success. Next, let's cover the training programs that are offered at Keller Williams. The first training program is KW Ignite, which is mostly for new agents to help them launch their careers and get into production, but is still effective for any agent regardless of where you are currently in your career. This is a foundational course covering the skills it takes to become the real estate expert of choice. The course consists of 18 instructor-led sessions and each Ignite day is divided up into two hours of hands-on instruction and two hours of lead generation using the Ignite success system. The four fundamental pillars covered in Ignite are becoming the real estate expert, creating a lead generation system based around your sphere of influence, creating a lead follow-up system using command, and managing the transaction from appointment to post-close. The next training program I wanted to cover is KW's Premium Training Bold offered through KW Maps. Bold is an intensive course that consists of a five and a half hour session once a week for eight consecutive weeks. This is a paid course in the cost of $800, but the office will reimburse you for the cost by rebating you when you close on buyers and sellers that are generated during the duration of the program. They also now offer a digital bold course for half the price at $399. The main difference between bold and other programs is the heavy focus on adopting the right mindsets to succeed in real estate. 
Bold training goes in depth on language techniques, business building strategies, and live lead generation activities. The next training offered is Keller Williams University or KWU for short. This is an online portal with countless real estate courses, material, and resources on everything you need to be successful. KWU provides an industry leading curriculum addressing every aspect of success in real estate. They have both paid and free courses and this is an amazing resource where you can learn to grow your business at your own pace. Next, let's go over the coaching programs provided by Keller Williams starting with Productivity Coaching. Productivity Coaching is a program where new agents get personalized training from a productivity coach to guide them through obtaining their first clients and working on their first transactions. The Productivity Coach is an experienced agent within the company who is there to keep agents accountable to doing the work that is necessary to generate leads and clients and guide them through their development into productive and successful agents. The next coaching program is KW Maps. KW Maps is Keller Williams in-house coaching program that stands for Mega Achievement Productivity Systems, providing a roadmap to success through premier coaching programs using the Keller Williams principles. This is a great option for agents looking to make an investment in themselves and their business through premium coaching services. These programs are offered either one-on-one -on -one or in group settings, include coaching sessions, and are each for a specific targeted aim. Some of the programs currently offered are Mastery, Bold, Breakthrough, Fast Track, Life Coaching, and 306090, and you can find more information on each program on the KW Maps website. The next aspect of the Keller Williams training model that I wanted to cover are the live events. In addition to the training and coaching programs, Keller Williams holds live events annually for KW agents nationwide to attend and network. These events have educational seminars and feature keynote speakers who are real estate industry leaders teaching what they know. The two live events that Keller Williams holds for all its agents across the country are KW Family Reunion and KW Mega Camp, which are multi-day educational events where you learn from some of the top real estate agents in the country, industry leaders, and founder and CEO Gary Keller himself. Keller Williams has also produced books authored by founder and CEO Gary Keller himself that have become cornerstone and foundational pieces of literature literature for anyone within the real estate industry. These books are The Millionaire Real Estate Agent, which gives a step-by-step -step blueprint on how to grow your real estate sales business to a million dollars a year and more, and Shift, which provides all the strategies to survive and thrive through housing market downturns and economic recessions. He has also written foundational books on real estate investing, such as The Millionaire Real Estate Investor, Flip, and Hold, for investors and real estate agents who want to understand real estate investing to service those clients or to eventually invest in real estate themselves. He also authored The One Thing, which is a best-selling book, not only for real estate agents, but for all entrepreneurs to be more productive and effective with their time. That was a lot to cover for training, and there's probably a lot more but these are the main focal points of the Keller Williams trading model, and now you can probably see why Keller Williams was named the number one training organization in the world, not only in real estate, but across all industries because of how much they value training and all of the training systems and programs that they have in place to ensure that their agents are operating at the highest skill level possible. Next, let's talk about the technology. In 2018, Gary Keller pronounced Keller Williams, a technology company, transitioning from previously being a real estate company. The company was making a full adoption of technology, and he pledged that the firm would invest over $1 billion into technological development, of which they have already invested over $170 million so far. In that time, they have developed a suite of tools that allow agents to work more efficiently with technology being at the forefront of their business. KW Tech starts 
with the Keller Cloud, which is a powerful suite of tools powered by AI and machine learning that works in harmony to deliver smarter business solutions to agents. One of the main technological components that have been incorporated into Keller Williams is KW Command, which is an in-house CRM for Keller Williams agents. This system allows you to manage all your contacts, relationships, deals, tasks, and more all in one place. A CRM could cost an agent anywhere from $50 to a few hundred a month, and Command is offered to all KW agents for free. A big component about Command is that the data is secure and the agent will always own their own data. This can sometimes be a concern when using another CRM from a third party company. The next major component of KW technology is the KW app. The Keller Williams app allows you to interact with your clients clients one-on-one -on -one where they can request tours and more features directly through your personalized app. It's kind of like having a personalized Zillow app branded exclusively to you. Keller Williams also has exclusive agreements and partnerships with major companies like Facebook and Google in developing their tech software and tools. Keller Williams has made the commitment to adapt to the new ways of doing business and remains on the cutting edge of technological advancements within the real estate space. They are continuing to develop the technology to make business more seamless and automated for the agent. I may have missed some of the additional tech because I'm honestly not the most savviest when it comes to that, but this is just the basics of what Keller Williams has going on in the technology space, and technology will definitely be continued to be incorporated into the Keller Williams model going forward. The next pillar to cover is profit share. Profit share is a unique way that the Keller Williams model helps its agents make more money by recruiting other agents into Keller Williams and growing the company further. The basics of how this works is once you recruit an agent to join into Keller Williams, once that agent begins to produce sales, that KW office will share the profits that that agent is bringing into the company with you. This profit share doesn't cost a new agent anything because it's not coming directly from their commission, but rather from the 30% commission split that they pay to the office before they cap. KW was the first real estate company to start a profit sharing model in 1986, and since then, Keller Williams has shared over $1.5 billion with its agents through this profit share. Profit share is a company-wide opportunity to recruit any agent anywhere to any Keller Williams office across the nation and not only just the one that you work for locally. I'm going to give you a full breakdown of the logistics of how this profit share model actually works. The monthly revenue that a Keller Williams office makes from its agent selling homes minus the expenses to operate that brokerage is referred to as the profit. Traditionally, all that profit would go to the owner, but at Keller Williams, it is split up where 52% of the profit from the company goes to the owner and the other 48% is split to the agents in the form of profit share. The profit share at Keller Williams runs seven levels deep and what this means is that you will earn a percentage of the profits not only on the agents that you recruit, but on the agents that those agents recruit, that they recruit, and so on for seven levels deep. When an agent joins KW, they will need to name a sponsor, and that sponsor should be the person who is most influential in their decision to join Keller Williams. As a named sponsor, you will be entitled to the profit share from the agent that you recruited, and this agent is now in your downline, where you will earn not only from their profits, but also from the profits of anyone else that they recruit. This is what the profit profit share schedule looks like and as you can see you will make the most profit share from the agents that you directly recruit of 50% of the profits that they are responsible for. But once again this is not the take home commission. Let's explain this more in detail with an example because I know it can get confusing. Let's say the agent you recruit closes his first deal for a $10,000 commission. He will pay the 30% or $3,000 to the KW office and the 6% or $600 to the franchise that he would have to pay anyways. The agent will still get his same $6,400 commission and the profit share doesn't affect that whatsoever. The profit share is on the $3,000 or 30% that was paid to the brokerage. So let's say the brokerage is operating at a 70% profit margin. That would mean that $2,100 of that commission split is profit. 
And from that, the owner of the brokerage keeps 52% or $1,092. The 48%, which is $1,008, goes to the profit share pool to be dispersed to the agents. So let's run this through the seven levels and show you how it would be broken down in this example. The agent that recruited the new associate would make 50% of the profit share, which in this case would be $504. The agent that sponsored the new associate sponsor would also also receive 10% of the profit share or $100.80. The agent that sponsored that agent would get 5% or $50.04. That agent sponsor also gets 5% or $50.04 again. Then the percentage of profit share begins to increase again from levels 5 to 7 where the next sponsor receives 7.5% or $75.60. That agent sponsor gets 10% or $100 and 80 cents and the agent that is seven levels deep of sponsorship gets 12 and a half percent of the profit share which in this case would be 135 dollars so this is how the profit sharing model is broken down throughout the seven levels of sponsorship and the more agents you bring in your profit share compounds exponentially to earn passive income and support you in retirement. This profit share continues throughout your entire retirement and lifetime long after you stop selling real estate. You even name a beneficiary who will assume these payments after you are gone to continue to support your family and your loved ones. Profit share really is a win-win for everyone where the agent gets an amazing brokerage to work with, Keller Williams gets to earn from the commission split that they paid to the company, and the sponsoring agent gets to share in those profits as well. It really is an amazing model that allows agents to create an additional income stream where they can generate more revenue in addition from their activities of helping clients buy and sell homes. The next pillar that we are going to cover is brand recognition. Brand recognition refers to the reputation and presence of a brand or a company. Brand recognition is important because it reflects how the brokerage is perceived by the public. Keller Williams has one of the strongest real estate brands as one of the most well-known real estate agencies in the entire country. They are ranked as the number one real estate brokerage by agent count, units sold, and total sales volume in the entire country. Statistics even show that one in every five homes that sold in the United States was sold by a Keller Williams agent. So chances are that most of your clients and prospects are somewhat familiar with Keller Williams and this really helps you as an agent. Keller Williams has also gone international with offices all over the globe and now has over 300 marketplaces in over 50 regions and five continents around the world. Keller Williams now has offices in places like Dubai, France, Taiwan, Bahamas, and all these other countries listed here. Keller Williams as a franchise now has the greatest total sales volume in the entire world. Not only does Keller Williams have a massive national and global brand, but even on a local level, the offices tend to be top producing brokerages with high sales volume and many of the top local agents working there. This means that the offices have a big presence in the local communities that you want to service and that is a tremendous benefit to you as an agent to be working at one of the top local firms. Next I want to talk about the support that is offered at Keller Williams. By support, I am referring to the staff and management within the office that is there to help you in your day-to-day -day operations as an agent and also help you solve problems as they arise. Most of the other agents at the office will provide assistance and answer your questions as well because that's just the nature and culture of Keller Williams, but there are some exclusively staff positions at KW whose sole job is to help the agents within their role. Each office has different positions filled, so make sure that you verify with the specific office that you are talking to, but some of the positions that may be there to help assist you in your day-to-day -day operations and with any potential issues are team leader, assistant team leader, market center administrator, director of agent services, director of first impression, and technology and marketing coordinators. Once again, each office is independently owned and operated, so I'm not 100% sure of what positions each office has filled, but generally there is a multi-person staff of full-time employees who are there to service the agents and be there for anything that they need. The next pillar I wanted to cover is the culture of Keller Williams. The culture at Keller Williams is really like no other real estate brokerage 
leverage around. It's all about agents helping other agents also succeed and it's kind of a vibe of that we're all in this together. Once again, most of the training classes are taught by the agents within the office sharing their own trade secrets of what works for them with other agents that are technically their competitors. It's an amazing atmosphere because there is no fear of competition and any agent success is always celebrated. In my local office, there is always a culture of learning, growth, and collaboration where if anyone ever needs something or has any questions, there is always someone available to help. The KW culture is also equally about giving back to the communities that we service. There are many contributions that highlight the culture of Keller Williams of giving back to the community and also putting their agents first, such as contributions like Red Day, KW Cares, KW Wellness, and the Agent Leadership Council. The ALC, or Agent Leadership Council, is comprised of members of the top 20% of the real estate agents within the office. This council can be thought of like some sort of board of directors who are actively involved in decisions to make the office more productive and profitable. The ALC is a prime example of how Keller Williams values their agents and allows them to be actively involved in decisions that impact the overall direction of the company. Red Day is Keller Williams annual day of service. Since 2009, the second Thursday of May is recognized as Red Day, which stands for Renew, Energize, and Donate. This is a day where Keller Williams offices around the nation and around the world commit to giving back to the communities that they serve through acts of community service for the betterment of that community. The next contribution is KW Cares, which is a public charity to support Keller Williams associates and their families in hardship as a result of a sudden emergency. These charitable funds are for associates who are facing tragic circumstances that they cannot handle on their own without the aid of additional assistance. Since the inception of KW Cares, 6,284 grants have been awarded, of which over $59 million of assistance has been provided. KW Cares really speaks to the heart of the culture at Keller Williams, looking out for the agents first and foremost. The next contribution is KW Wellness, which was created specifically with the health of the KW associates at the forefront. This contribution offers a suite of resources that supports mental, emotional, and physical health. This wellness platform was created to ensure that both agents and leadership alike are taking good care of themselves and their health in addition to their business. This platform includes resources like wellness experiences, destination retreats, live and virtual events, content from pro wellness experts, learning events, daily motivations, healthy lifestyle resources, and more. As independent contractors, we as real estate agents do not get the same job benefits such as health insurance. KW Wellness has also set up health insurance programs with health providers for agents to purchase to have plans for themselves and their families. These contributions are just some of the ways that you will see the Keller Williams Agent First Giving Back Culture highlighted. So this is my full breakdown of the Keller Williams brokerage model and what they have to offer. I really covered a lot of information today and I know that it's a lot to take in so if at some point you need to come back to a certain spot just feel free to return to this video anytime and use the chapters below. So once again the content of this video is based on my personal experience of working at Keller Williams for three years now and based on the research that I did so maybe everything may not be a hundred percent accurate so make sure that you verify with the offices that you speak to but I really did try Try to do my best when researching the topic. For me, joining Keller Williams helped me completely transform my career from selling almost nothing to now being one of the top producing agents at my office. Now your success will always be predicated on what you personally do as an agent, but I have found that Keller Williams really does a great job at helping you bring out the best version of yourself. In picking a brokerage, it is never a one size fits all for all agents, but the overall package offered at Keller Williams really felt like a no brainer for me personally. If you have any questions about this video, Keller Williams, or really anything at all, I'm going to be leaving my email in the description below so you can 
email me there. I really hope that you could appreciate all the research and information that went into making this video. And if you did, then please subscribe to my channel just for how long this took me to research and to put this whole video together. And of course, for more real estate content coming soon. And I'll see you guys in my next video.